and the Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission has recommended prosecution of former Tourism Cabinet Secretary Najib Balala, his Principal Secretary Lea Nguyo, former Tourism Fund CEO Alan Chenane, and 13 others over the embezzlement of 8.5 billion shillings earmarked for the construction of the coast branch of the Kenya Utali College. Well, EACC, which presented the file to the Office of the Director of Public Prosecutions, wants Balala charged with irregularities in the award of a tender. The EACC found the cost of setting up the college as inflated to 10.4 billion shillings, up from the initial cost of 1.95 billion shillings. Chamatai Goen has the details. The ESCC has been on the radar of senior officials who previously served in the tourism ministry, which at the time was led by Cabinet Secretary Najib Balala, the anti-corruption body, also eyeing then PS Lea Guio and the former tourism fund CEO, among others, over reported fraudulent acquisition of public monies. According to ESCC, the tourism fund illegally paid 8.5 billion shillings for the setting up of a satellite Utali college in the coast region. The 8.5 billion shillings arising from the inflation of the cost of establishing the branch from 1.5 billion shillings to 10.4 billion shillings. In its investigations, ESCC says it established through a cabinet memo signed by then Cabinet Minister Najib Balala on 22nd May 2007 and his finance counterpart on 20th August 2007 that the construction of the college to be based in Vipingo was approved at a cost of 1.94 8 billion shillings. ESCC's probe roped in some private consultants contracted by the tourism fund to come up with architectural designs and drawings of the college and to also supervise the main contractor. The drawings and designs were approved with a cost of 8.6 billion shillings. The tender for construction of the coast branch of the Kenya Utali College, later renamed Ronald Ngala Utali College, was awarded in May 2013 at a cost of 8.9 billion shillings against the approved cabinet amount. ESCC says the named individuals conspired to defraud the public with the office holders going ahead to approve payments, yet they were well aware that there weren't sufficient resources in the budget. The report now under review in the DPP's office recommends the prosecution of Balala, the then PS, former CEO of the Catering Tourism and Development Levy Trustees, the then CEO of the Catering Tourism and Development Levy Trustees, the procurement manager, baseline architects, Repman Malala T-Stroke Eugency Consultants, Amitech Consulting Engineers and members of the tender committee. ESCC has recommended five counts of willful failure to comply with procurement laws as read alongside the Anti-Corruption and Economic Crimes Act 2003, four counts of unlawful acquisition of public property and one count of abuse of office. Further charges are imposed on the CEO of the Catering, Tourism and Development Levy Trustees, members of the Tender Committee, the sole proprietor of Ugenzi Consultants, directors of Mulji Devraj and Brothers Limited, to include one count of deceiving principle contrary to the law. Investigations show that the land which the college was to be built on was donated by the Rev Pingo Company Limited. Chemutai Go in Citizen TV.